So we had a pretty strong schedule to start the season. Unfortunately, because of COVID, we had to cancel a lot of our uh, out-of-state tournaments. We've changed to a lot of one-day events, so we're limiting our overnight stays. And almost all of our events are placed in Michigan now. It's definitely going to be a lot different. Typically, we get to travel outside of Michigan, but this year we've got to keep it local, which is really good, actually, for all of our parents and friends and family if they want to come out and watch. However, we do need to keep social distance in mind. Another thing that's a little bit different in the golf world is we can't pull the pin out, so that's been a big adjustment for a lot of us. Other than that, we're still playing, so everyone's really excited to get out on the course. This Tuesday the 8th, we travel to Lords's course, which is borderline Michigan, Sylvania, Ohio, and that's going to be a big tournament. Lords is a big competitor of ours. Towards the end of the month, we've got another big tournament coming up. We're hoping to go up to Harbor Shores, which is up north. It's a beautiful course right on the water, so this year we've got a lot of good competition, but we've also got a lot of good players. Our schedule is one of our best recruiting tools. We go to a lot of cool places that not a lot of NAIA schools go to. So it was a big hit, but these guys are still ready to play. The men's team is looking really, really strong. We've got a really strong class and we got a, a lot of good returning players. We've definitely got a lot of strong competition on our team alone. So I, if I were the other teams, I'd watch out. So the off season for golf is a little bit different because it is an individual sport. So it's kind of on you to practice. However, we do have a really hard working group of girls. So if I had to say, everybody practiced a lot because we all came back a lot stronger and a lot better than last year. It was unfortunate to have our season taken from us last season, but I think everybody took it as motivation just to get better for the upcoming season and we all came back a lot better. A lot of our teams have backed out of uh, some of the tournaments that we are hosting. I know in the WAC preview because our championship is in the spring and we've had about four or five of the WAC teams back out. We won't be able to see all of them before the championship like we usually do, but I think we're pretty strong this year.